Yo, what is up, everybody? Welcome back to Psychopaths React Andy. Tonight we are on season three, episode four. Um, last time, what even happened? Uh, WWE guy, his best friend got murked. Uh, rest in peace, my boy Lee. Never forgotten. Uh, a couple other things happened that I'm. We we met like the got more information about like the first inspector, second inspector, third inspector. I think we did we meet the woman, the ex woman, second inspector last time. I think we did. I think that was the last episode. Um. And she was an entire character. We got some more more backstory about our two enforcers, Todoroki and the guy whose name I'm forgetting. Uh, the short name, the gangster guy. Um, so they're actually a lot more plot substantial than you might have expected previously. Uh, more than I personally expected, which is interesting. Um, homeboys Arata and Kei are still the two best in people on the entire planet. I must have said enforcers, but they're not enforcers. Yayoi's back in the picture for some reason. I mean, like, welcome back, Yayoi. She's like a yo-yo. She always comes back. Whoa, think about it. That's crazy. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, honestly, let's just get right into it. Um, I do appreciate in the comments letting me know the guy from last episode. Um, for, what's his name? I have the, the video pulled up. Oh, no, I closed it. Um, I'm pulling my own video back up so I can read the comments. That's how important the comments are, guys. I listen. I read every single one. Which isn't actually saying a lot because there's like, you know... I don't know. I, I almost just like said that there's not that many comments, but like that's a weird thing to say. But like, you know, you know what I'm talking about. What's important though is Azusawa. Azusawa is that weird guy that was like freaking out with the noodles and has the doll looking lady. She's act, or he is actually the first inspector dude. I thought they were two different people, but they looked similar. They were just acting so different, bro. Threw me off. Um, let's just get right into the episode, though. episode four. Um, I'm a little offbeat, you know, I did get the best sleep last night, I will be honest, but that's okay, we don't need sleep where we're going, uh, because it's overrated. We're gonna do a quick little forehead episode, you know how it goes, it's been a while, 3, 2, 1, BAM! We also got, oh, what's up, Yayoi? I'll wait, I'll wait, you know, I'll wait for the other, for the, uh, the intro cinematics to roll before I start talking about myself. What's up, Hina? Oh, look, reintegrated herself, she's probably, she fixed her, her criminal thing. Right? That's crazy. Good job, Yayoi. Freaking Yayoi. Man, Yayoi, you gotta get some drip. What is that? Did you see that? All she's got is a jacket, t-shirt, jeans. Come on, you look like me. You can do better. Okay, well, let's go say. Got the Dr. Pepper. Sadly, this isn't Dr. Pepper from last night, so it's it's kind of lacking the, uh, the spice factor. It is what it is. Um, we also got the Glacier Clear Purified Drinking Water, unopened, Un look at this, the seal on that, should be exciting. I also got my dinner, you want to see my dinner? Well, I'll show you my dinner. I think it's exciting. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at it. Oh, yeah. I'm excited, baby. This got, like, chicken, barbecue sauce, onions, lettuce, tomatoes, some little bit of beans, a little bit of rice. I love Arata so much. He might be my favorite character. I'm gonna say how it is. He's a Giga Chad. I think he is. I think I might even say that he is my favorite. I don't know. Right now... Wait, K K's fighting himself. That's interesting. That's very interesting. And then they do the long shot here, bro. Of the boys. The lads, the gentlemen. I love him so much. I love him so much. What a weird OP, though. It ends in such a weird way. P political strife in the Coliseum. The WWE. Think about it. Fake, fake death? Hey? Oh. They're like putting them into hibernation? Cryo-freezing them? Why am I looking around? What am I looking for? <laughs> Good point. But there has to be at least one person that, know that is like puppeteering it all. But that's been the thing all along, right, with the, um, 
the crashed uh, airplane. That they're like fragmenting the responsibility of the crash and far enough into like a bunch of little pieces so that nobody's here's getting that clouded. But like, is there a mastermind? And if so, like, how does the mastermind uh, factor into this? Though the mastermind could be anyone in the Bifrost because they're under, they're they're the, um, the Illuminati. What was that? What was that face? Is K still suspended? K might still be suspended. Oh yeah, he punched that guy. Last episode. That was kind of crazy. He got ticked. He got ticked. He, he was uh, protecting homeboy Todoroki's honor, bro. It's kind of crazy. Bro, get my phone out of my pocket. You ever try to sit down with a phone in your pocket? Not a good move. Oh, that's sad. Oh, let me move it over here. Yeah, that's it. Four letters. I love him. He's so fun. Okay, yeah, he's still suspended. I see. Because it's just them three. I bet he feels kind of responsible for it. Because he did get suspended by, you know, punching the guy that was spitting, spitting shade at Mr. Todoroki. So, a little bit of, little bit of guilt there, perhaps. Um, I think we're on Irei's lead. If I... Fair call, right? The animation this episode. <laughs> Some of their faces looked a little off. Just, just a tiny bit. It's okay. It's okay. I'll give it a pass. They're overworked. What is this? What is that? I am public safety. <laughs> we are public safety. Is your AI smart enough to register that, dweeb? <laughs> Why is she looking at me like that? Bro, I don't know who Dr. Choya is. There's too many names. Mm, can't use Google. Oh. Wait. Bro, I have no idea what's going on. They're purging. They're purging everything. Oh, just kidding. They're giving it all to the, the Baroque? Pog. Who's the witch doctor? Is she the mastermind, bro? Why is she so suspicious? Look at her. Did you hear that echo? It's crazy. They're really trying to sell. They're trying to get me immersed. Wait, what? <laughs> Irei. Yeah, Irei. Sit this one out. Dang. Brain works hard. Shout out. Wait, what part of that? You want to lessen your cognitive load? You want to take a little bit of a break? I understand. Yeah. <laughs> that person is weeping. <laughs> oh, okay. It so it was the guy that died. Um, that was working with her, probably, right? The one that jumped out of the building. Oh, what's up, Kay? Wait, what? Wait, what? 
Is she not real? Wait, what are you saying? Did he create an AI copy of, of her? And she took it back? Okay. Okay, so he made Robo Karina, like AI Karina. Excuse me? She is the person from the, from the, she's talking about Karina. She is the person from the end of the OP that's like laying down the four times. I think it's the same necklace. What? <laughs> what? What are you talking about? That doesn't make any sense. Okay. Yeah, okay. It's fine. Just take a sip of the DP. Calm yourself. She loves her smoking. Stressful job, can't blame her. <laughs> oh, are you back on the case? What's good with you? Oh, okay. Good move. That's funny. Okay, so she's in control of the AI version of herself, and they've synced up and are, like, acting together. I don't understand why this is happening, but all right. Like, like, why is this plot point being developed? It's just, like, I don't know. It's very interesting. Oh, that's her, uh, her project manager. I know your trick. You're just gonna say that out loud? Well, what's there to be exposed? Like, uh, I'm working with an AI version myself? That's kind of Giga Chad. If I split into two and there were two of me and there was an AI me and a real me, that's cool. Like, that's a, that's a good gimmick. Yeah. <laughs> there's gotta be, there's, there's more going on. There's definitely more going on right now than just an AI copy. All right, these are all the people that were uh, frozen, hyper, yeah. Are these the valet men? Okay, so this is the Bifrost people, I think. Gigandas, Giganda. Um, so that's how the Bifrost were getting the people around was through the, the cooling. All right, Yayoi, welcome. Welcome aboard. An idol lip syncing to a full body hollow. But I just don't understand like, why you would do that. Ah, okay, so she's hiding it because it's illegal to do that, which makes sense why that would be illegal. Oh, is it like her ghostwriter? Oh no, explain it to me. You're smarter than I am, Arata. Oh, it's the, the perfect tone stuff that the doctor was talking about. That's why she's doing it. Okay, I connected. So like, it's like optimizing and being the perfect voice and all that kind of crap to like, to like, uh, talk to the crowd the best. That makes sense. Okay, I got there. Like the resonant frequency of your brain. Trick people into taking a cognitive load off. <laughs> yeah, wait, why are you talking about journalism? We're not talking about journalism. <laughs> okay, I guess that's fair. Group think. Sheeple. Yep, sheeple. Group think. 
And we got a bunch of freaking... Oh, K found it. A bunch of, um... Compromised Hugh people running around. <gasps> oh, he dodged a taser shot. Good move. You ever heard of a weight class? That guy was thick. What is it? Yes, sir. Oh, look at all their hollow stuff. Is this what is this what politics is gonna be one day? Is this gonna happen in my lifetime? In your lifetime? It could. Oh, those people are unconscious. Was that a bomb? Oh, they're jamming a certain area. Interesting. But why? Take a sip. Yaku Shiji better not be uh, betraying me right now. Probably the project manager of um, the idol. Gotta be the project manager. Well, the, the Bifrost people want to do that, but I don't know who they are. Oh, I guess she is one of them. Yeah. Oh, and then First Inspector is the other one. <laughs> Kate doesn't care about weight class. Just gotta hit him in the jaw. Dude, the lights are flickering. Hello? Oh, is this a joke? Are they pranking? What? Okay, yeah, it's the Bifrost. They're about to throw hands. Oh, this is- okay, this is the, uh, second- this is the second inspector's dude. So this is all her. <gasps> yes! No! No! Gekyu Shiji! Throw some hands! It's not the project manager, she's just running. She's kidnapping her! No, Makarina. She dead? No, she's just unconscious. Yeah, that was a little neck chop. Okay. So... Yeah? What, what is this? What is this? She's tweaking. Oh, this is kind of terrifying. <laughs> okay, had nothing to do with anyone. It was just no, no, no project, no, no project manager, no nothing. It was all the Bifrost people, all the second inspector. Well, I don't even know. Are the second inspector and the Bifrost people even the same thing? Bro, I don't know. All of all, all number two though. They just kidnapped both the politicians, or just her actually. I don't know if they kidnapped Yakushija. Maybe, maybe not. Uh oh, this is bad. This is awful. Uh oh. All I had was a hologram. Why would you refuse that? You were helpful. What are you doing to her? He just did Super Mario 64. 
Kay! Good move, Kay, good move. Ooh! <laughs> Just watching. No, Kay's gonna lose to the big guy, though. Look at the big guy. Ow, ow, how many bones? Ow. She thought he was going crunch, crunch, crunch. Hina, <laughs> Hina, <he> do. <laughs> what is Hina doing? What's up, lady? Hey, she's not plot essential. That's cool. She's just kind of there. Close the elevator. Is big guy going to be able to open it? Yeah, he is. Oh, wait. Oh. Okay, I thought I thought they were. Oh, it's so gross. Every time it happens, it's just disgusting, man. The bubble. The dominator, bu the patent pending dominator bubble pop. Okay, so I don't. I, I'm curious as to why Inspector Two or Second Inspector would have even wanted to kidnap, or like, I guess not kidnap necessarily, but force her to apologize. Like, why do they care? Is that K? Yeah. Okay, K came in clutch, per usual. Is what he does. What are you gonna do? Hit me with a chair? Zap! <laughs> Give me my water. Dang, Todoroki, you know how to fence? Do you see that? He got them fancy moves. In the neck? Oh, it wasn't enough. Hey, thank you, Yayoi. Tooth! A tooth! Oh, they got completely uh, curb stomped. Like, that wasn't even close. I guess the, um, the guy in the hood that, like, looks weird, he got away. Or... No, he's still chasing the girl. We don't know where the girl is. I just bumped it, sorry. Sorry, teehee. <laughs> what I do is up to me, Giga Chad. Ooh, Todoroki liked that. Todoroki will remember that. That's crazy. Didn't recommend it. That's interesting. Whoa. Good line. Yeah, you and Arata are pretty much the best. Hello, yeah. stun baton. Appreciate you. Appreciate you, Todoroki. I like how Todoroki's been, you know, acting acting a little more chat like. Gotta respect it. Oh, is that a campaign manager? Oh, that's her. I think both of them. Sniper. Oh, they don't have a sniper one. If they had the sniper one, they could do it. I think Arata is just way too good at parkour for like no reason. <laughs> Look at him go, dude. Triple triple front flip? Like why? <laughs> why? Good back flip. What do you recognize this guy? You went to grade school with him? He just went through his legs. 
Yeah, you're gonna do a little squee. Wait, whoa. He's been sharing abandoned zone information with Akane? Whoa, they just slid that in. You know, he's giving him the gentleman's duel. He's not doing the, uh, he's, he could just, he just cap him if he wanted. Thanks, Ide. I don't know, Tai, you got it. <laughs> it did nothing. It literally did nothing. Got it. The Glock. The Glock. Bing, bing, bing. Yes. Is it not going to have a crime coefficient? Is it just a cyborg? Whoa, whoa. Oh my god. Ah! This is an awful position. What is that? Permission to murder? Why would they say that out loud? <laughs> His upper body strength. <laughs> Why is it this device is so good? How did he do that? He got a pretty girl on him, though. Plus. What is he, a combustion man? Okay, literally a machine. <laughs> okay, don't try to grab him. Okay, so it was just straight up a robot. I thought it was a dude that had stuff on him. No, it's just a robot. <laughs> I don't think you can hand to hand a robot. It's a robot. Like, what are you gonna do? Oh! <gasps> it hit him. It got him. Oh, got him on the, the gut. No gut, gut slash. <laughs> you didn't. This guy was just... Just throwing... Throwing hands. Yeah? Did you see that? Did you see how they, like... They made him look so goofy for a frame there. Don't yada yada at me. Hmm. <laughs> Okay, Ida, go help K. Go help Todoroki before he gets his head cut off. Shouldn't the Dominator go into, like, uh, destruction mode like it does with vehicles? That's what they really need right now. Though he did say he couldn't get a lock, so maybe there's the jamming thing going on still. Yeah, they did mention the jamming, actually. Off the edge? Homeboy really swan dived. He just let that happen. Wow, that worked. Bro, I need to rewatch Adorata somehow throwing the girl and then jumping and landing under her as a cushion. I need to see that again. Wait, so they just got the dub. They just completely won. I was expecting them to lose. It's episode four. This is where you're supposed to be losing. You know what I mean? Oh, good night. <laughs> what is he? Goofy. Oh, she likes him. She likes him. Did you see that? Bro, Yaku Shija, you got one tapped by a dude. Come on, man. I thought you could throw hands. You're WWE.
So Enomiya, is that the girl? I think that's the woman, the ex-woman. Yeah? Called out. Oh yeah, the Todoroki family drama. What's up, Yaki? She just talked to me. Respectable. They just giga chat walk away. Okay, Todoroki, being the, the bigger man. Okay. <laughs> Some of these scenes, man, it's like, what? Okay. Is she on the run? Oh, is that first? Hey, it's first. What's good? Yeah, so second just fumbled and did awful. Oh, because she was trying to copy his move, right? So she just sucks. I thought she was going to pop off, dude. This guy. Okay, yeah, he's definitely the same guy. No wonder. Oh, he's got hand to hand. What is he, like a drunken kung fu master? Look at the way he's moving. What was that? <laughs> Some weird arm lock into a kick? <laughs> what? Okay. Are you going to pull a knife? That means you've lost the fight. Did he just catch the thrown knife? Okay, so... I, I Okay, so I, I think I, I'm pretty much understanding what the whole deal was second and what just happened. I was just expecting it to go so much worse. Like, look at her. She's just got her, she just got her face kicked in by this dude. And she's about to get caught. Or something. Or dead. Yeah. What? What's in your briefcase? Oh, all your money? Who is it? We planned for you to try to interfere. Oh, okay, so she was working for Yakushiji to expose Koimiya, or whatever her name is, as a hollow trick to get more favor for him. But in trying to do that, she was actually being puppeteered by the rest of the Bifrost who were wanted Karina to win. And they wanted her to win in a specific way. And now, she's getting executed. Yep. You'd be safe if you took the stairs. Yeah, always take the stairs in an emergency situation. Bye bye. Have fun. Have fun in the depths. You weren't pretty and you weren't nice. <laughs> this guy is so goofy. Did you see the moves he started pulling as soon as right before they fought? What was that? Oh, your, your arm got busted, Arata? Is she covering? She covered for- she made it happen! Okay, Mika. Bring it in, Mika. Oh, Mika, that was so sweet of you. 
She is a little scheming fox. Okay. Okay. That that just warmed my heart a little bit. Non-alcoholic for Yayoi? Oh. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> Don't want to be an alcoholic. So, uh... Mokahita lady is gonna... Huh? He is so drunk. Look how drunk he is. <laughs> he is so... Oh, he wants to vote. Oh, no. Ida, it's okay. Oh, he wants to give a kiss. Yep. But it was all schemed. It was schemed from behind. Dang. Hue correction? What is that? Wait, his hue got bad enough that he just lost like 20% of the votes? That's crazy. So when everything went wrong like this and then he was explained the situation by the Barreau, his his hue went his hue went wild. Wow. That's crazy. Yeah, that's kind of what I was saying. Like, who cares that much if the AI is doing doing so much legwork? Because, I mean, it's still, you know, I don't know. Like, there's already systems. Systems that are in place that give more information to people that are like politicians or whatever. Like, an AI is just like a in-the-moment version of that that's also doing speech, speech and psychology stuff. I don't know. I didn't. I could see it being a problem in like, like the real world if someone managed to do that to that degree. But like in the psychopath kind of system, AI is a bit everywhere. You know, hollows are everywhere. I could see it being less of an issue for sure. I was not expecting the hue thing to be as big as it was though. I'm gonna make politics fun like a concert or a TV show. Cap. Mika, come join the party. What was that? No, Mika, bring it in. Look at Ire, you think... You think he can even think straight right now? Don't even sweat it. That's true. It was a client's work. Okay. But why? Okay, but how? So are they like betting on the results of all these events that are taking place and then trying to like adjust them? I'm a little confused about how the money ties in and like the whole betting system. Who is that? Oh, the... Oh! Hey, didn't I say that they were gonna that she had some eyes on him? I mean, he's pretty cute. Uh, children as the parents' property. Um, I don't like the idea of people being other people's property. Sorry.
You know I'm going to lose my mind if either of them make a romantic move, by the way. I just got to say that out loud. Ooh, that's a pretty shot. The helmet riots. Oh, I remember that. Whoa, that's crazy. I was there. You were there. That was seven years ago. Holy crap. Was that season one? Yeah, that was that was um Daft Punk. That was like episode like twelve or something. Compasses. Are they in the fer first wheel? I think they're in the first wheel. Look at it. It's a big chamber. He knows because he's an empath. <laughs> that's that's funny. That's a good line. Oh no. Yeah. That's one way to look at it. I mean, ignorance is a bliss, right? Shoot. This is getting too deep. I'm, I, I, I'm. It's too deep for me right now. I kind of like people who call themselves evil. I'm glad I voted for you. Aww. You're running out of time, baby girl. Got to make your move on him. Stop talking about the AI. I want you guys to get together. I'm actually interested in this. This is important. Which means they were fine with it. Yeah. They accepted it. What happened to Macarena? Is she dead? Because she got all spazzy and weird and then disappeared. But like, she's an AI, so what are the rules? Okay, that's something. Hmm? He didn't get any juice, not tonight. All, all he got was a let's meet again soon. Did he, did she even give you your, her, bleh, did she even give you her phone number? Okay, they found the body. We already knew that, because we're ahead of the game. Oh, what's up, Todoroki? Another business card? Didn't Kogami give him the original one? Are these all tied to Akane? Oh my goodness, what is going on? Yeah, they got the wolf on him. Is this a who? Akane? Is that Akane the tunnel? But then who died? Or is this someone else? That could have been someone else. I don't know. Okay. That music does something.
Oh, we haven't even seen this all episode. Oh, it's a tiny baby. Is it a fox? Not a not a wolf, but a fox? Is it is his dad like on the council or something? Did they end the okay. They didn't end the episode. This is Sybil, right? They changed their like their look. I don't know. Let's just listen. Shh, shh, shh. I said, shut up. Who she got on her computer? I don't know. One of them kind of looked like me, Loki. Okay, so they're hunting Bifrost. I think the foxes is Bifrost, or the inspectors, which is tied to Bifrost. Okay, so basically, so basically, so basically, we're at the situation where everything that went right during this episode was actually part of Bifrost's plan. So really it wasn't going right because I don't think, because Bifrost is the antagonist. Or at least I'm led to believe that. So that's not good. Also, Idol Lady might be more important going forward because Bifrost wanted her to be in control, wanted her to be the governor, as well as her AI to get revealed. I don't know why they would want the AI to be revealed. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I have, I have no idea. Um, I, I don't know how, I guess, my guess actually is that Akane was pursuing these guys and then got outplayed or not necessarily outplayed, but then hit the point where she had to, um, like, pull herself out of the game and put other inspectors in, which is Arata K and, like, Gami and all them, um, to finish, like, what she started with the whole Bifrost Fox thing. I think she was already working on it, um, and then got put, maybe she was the one that Todoroki was just talking about being institutionalized, um, but now she's having to, like, everyone else is having to finish what she started. Um... No, no, no end credits, no nothing crazy. Um, though I do need to skip through this episode a little bit. Because a lot of, this was like, I was expecting it to go wrong. Because we're at the point where like, midway through a season, I feel like things start to go wrong. And then near the end of the season, it like fixes. Or like we get some sort of resolution, right? But it seems that this kind of like, capped itself and concluded itself. And I wasn't expecting it to. So that's pretty normal for psychopaths to like subvert me a little bit in like the pacing the pacing's a little um offbeat in a lot of ways which isn't necessarily bad it's just it is what it is um the hollow thing that kind of can't feel like it came out of nowhere a little bit i guess it was just an example of her uh like skirting the system and not being completely honest with the public but then the public didn't even care so i don't really know what the point of that was but apparently it was important enough to buy frost that they wanted it to get revealed so something was important about it and also explains and ties in the whole doctor thing better and how he was attached to the AI version of her, not her him, herself. Um, and then he eventually killed himself or whatever. Um, or got killed. I mean, was provoked into suicide through the TV thing. Um, but it seems that this was all planned by by Frost. Most, most specifically, probably the first inspector. But now I'm starting to get curious if Arata is directly tied to the fox, right? De directly tied to the Bifrost? Because, I mean, let's see. He got green, yellow eyes. He got that, you know, the kind of brownish black, the brownish hair. And then First Inspector. Can I get a close-up of First Inspector, my little Firsty boy? Firsty boy, where are you? I want to see your eye color. I mean, it's kind of yellowish. It's darker hair, but uh, I don't know. It's just being, a... and they have a similar temperament, being all weird and like stupid. But Arata does it better. I, it might be Arata's dad. It could be. Is it a stretch? Maybe. Am I gonna double down on it? Yeah, probably. Because that would. It's the fox head. The fox head with the empath ability. 
being tied to the fox on the card, which is tied to Bifrost. That's the connection I'm making. And it would make sense that there was some weird, suspicious stuff that happened with his... Did his dad die? What happened? Oh yeah, both his parents died. But, you know, just because they died doesn't mean they're dead. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, they could have faked their death, right? Like, you know, could be an option. Um... Or at least that Bifrost was somehow connected in his in Arata's parents dying through the hands of Kay's dad or uncle or whatever it is. I know there's that the family like killing between each other thing that kind of went on. I wouldn't be su surprised if Bifrost kind of kind of was part of that. Um, I do want Arata and the idol to get together because I think that'd be hilarious, but it probably isn't going to happen. Maybe it will. Maybe it will. Got to have hope. Oh, that'd be so good. Could you imagine? Though, honestly, them fighting the robot and winning, I don't know, man. I don't know. How are you supposed to beat a robot? You punch it, it doesn't care. Like, what are you going to do? Damage its internal components? I don't know, man. But I've never punched a robot, so maybe I just am not, I don't have enough expertise in the matter. Um, okay, well, shoot. Yeah, I'm just, I'm a little surprised, like I've been saying, that it wrapped up as cleanly as it did with this episode. Um, but this is all just setting up the first inspector and the rest of the Bifrost to do something really crazy down the line. So, and we still need the entire resolution for what's going on with Akane. We need the entire resolution for what's going on with Arata and K, uh, and Arata's ability, yada, yada, yada. Like there's a lot of stuff going on. So, uh, it does kind of make sense that they actually did wrap this up, but yeah, that will be all for episode four of Psychopaths. On to episode five. This is the halfway point. That's half of the season and there's one more season coming up next which is first inspector which its title is very similar to you know the first inspector is kind of a thing that's going on here so that's kind of threatening um but yeah on to the next on to episode five but until then until the next episode that's all i got for you tonight i'll be your guys great rest of your day night dawn evening whatever it is hope it's great whatever you're doing hope you do great but until then until the next episode i'm out of here peace